quick check one two bear with me pretty still pleases so a little preview there of what we are going to be playing so pardon me while I set something up here on my, my iPad Just want me to update Twitch. All right, fine, fine. I'll update Twitch. Bear with me, folks. Just setting things up. Hopefully, you can hear me this time because the last time I streamed, my microphone decided not to work. And you heard like almost nothing of my voice when I played. And, you know, it was the actual gameplay itself was running fine. Audio, like the game audio and everything, nice and smooth and clear. Just no audio from me. So it was just like watching random game footage. Isn't that fun? So today we're trying something, you know, a little different. This is a game that I don't have much... Um history with. All right. Got the thing set up so I can hopefully see you guys if anyone joins me. All right, we are in it. So this is what we're going to be playing. And before I let the intro for the game go, because I, I do want to watch it, I want to say, first of all, if anyone is tuning in later on because I hopefully if the video quality is good I will put this on YouTube so if you see it then thank you for watching thank you for joining me um, this so this game here actually you can kind of see the other ones I've got for the Sega thing maybe we'll do some other ones later so last time I did Sega game and I'm not even gonna hide the fact that I'm playing on Steam was this, and this is kind of the game that made me not want to stream, not because it was a bad game, and I was having bad trouble, but my mic audio was so bad, it was essentially unwatchable. It was just a garbled, horrible mess. And so this time, I want to try, I want to go back to this game, not this game in particular, but this series type stuff to see if it's a little better because I have a, a more steady internet connection now and I want to play a game that I've never played. In fact, I've never played the first Toe Jam and Earl. No, this is not the first one. I believe this is the second one. The one that people talk about less. Uh, my only history with this game is that a friend of mine had it and he played it and I saw, I've seen it, but I myself have never played this game and my memory of this game is vague at best. All I know of it is you're on the planet Funkotron and humans have invaded and you're trying to get them off the planet. That's it. That's all I know. So hopefully this all works correctly. But uh, let's, let's dive in. I'm gonna say Sega. Oh, come on. Well, that's Toe Jam. And Darby Earl. Right, so, no story beats, just right into a preview of it. So, let's dive in. Oh, here we go. Hello. <laughs> 
the things. The things are terrible. Yeah, we do do that, don't we? Is that guy naked in the box? A, B, and C. I'm using an Xbox controller. Game tips are off. Well, let's, let's actually have a look. No, I don't want... That's not what I wanted. Okay, the A button was not A. What is A? Uh, X? Okay. So we'll have to figure this out. Let's just jump in. Let's be both. Let's have both. Alright, so I can't do anything with that. What is jump? Okay, that is the throw button. I don't know what that is. vacuum. set the game because I think I accidentally selected two players all right let's skip this so let's do just toe jam let's see how that again hitting the wrong button cool okay I can freely move now Oh, come on, 
man. This thing is creepy. Is, but we're going in. All right. All right. Uh, I don't know what I'm getting. I'm very confused. Oh. Oh. Oh, yeah, okay. 
vaguely remember this. I don't really... Thanks. I'm, I don't know what funks are. Get in there. So should I go back and just clear the wood? Yeah, let's go back, I guess. So I kind of skip that whole underwater area. Remember, I I want to say that they can eventually break out of the jars if you don't get them right away. I do find it funny that you shove them in jars. thing okay I see what I got you there I'm sure there's people who have played this game before and are like idiot Goodbye. you surprised me dude Oh, 
Okay, I can see. So, uh, so I do not remember the construction guys. I don't remember baseball player kid. But I do remember there was one uh, Earthling that we were like, really? This is an Earthling? Awesome. But uh, you, there's a, a boogeyman? I don't want to do that. Gotcha. It's just, like, I just remember when my friend was playing this. He's like, oddly enough, this is a thing. I just remember it goes. And hopefully we won't counter him. But he goes, boogie 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 boogie. Is this death? Let's see. That was worth it. damage I took just then? Awesome. Awesome. This is a thing. Known. 
I mean, it's good he's got mad ups, but... But, uh... Once you're in the air, control is garbage. Also, leaving the water is tougher than it should be. All right. Really, that's nothing. Awesome. All right. Please jump. Yum yum yum. Sort of. 
and I have no idea how. He actually runs on his own. that he can just like if you walk into a wall as you notice he just sort of glides into it like that it's very odd I 
do like that noise though. I think I can kind of make it. Alright. jump. Out of the water, please. Out. Get out of the water. Get out of the water, please. Right. Oh. Thank you. 
cannot get out of the water. What's down? What's down here? the exit? Do I want to keep trying to go? So, I know a lot of people love the first Toe Jam and Earl. And that's another one I've actually never played myself either. Um, I can see why this one maybe didn't do as well. So this was just not not nice to play. Get it.
this one more try. Something. Maybe just ignore the, the button there. And just make a leap of faith. <laughs> I don't know how to get up there. But, uh, that's this game. Thank you for joining me in this. Well, you know, I never played it before, now I can say I have. So, uh, thank you for watching. See you next time.